Good evening. It's time to play some one-on-one -on -one once again. Let's see who will be the first one in chat. Will be will it be Dev or someone else? Who's the fastest? Dumb Quake it was. Hello, hello. Welcome to the stream. Good to have at least one viewer. And that was fast. Well deserved first. How are you today, Tom Quake? Everything good? Let's see how many players we have today. Steam charts. 246 playing 22 minutes ago. We had a slight peak during the DreamHack winter, but then, then again the numbers have gone down a bit. Hello, Sober Decay. Well, that is exactly what it what the population is like. You should check uh, Steam charts. It should give you a, quite a good picture of the current situation. Although you don't necessarily need Steam to play the game, so it's not exactly accurate. It's hard to estimate how many players there are using the Bethesda launcher. That is the alternative. But at least the trend doesn't look very good. It's been going down and down and down. Yes, very bad numbers. If if you go to steamcharts.com and I will give you the link if you and if you check the how do you see the like top fifty games? Oh more, yeah, there's the link. There are so many games that I have never even heard of that are, I don't know, 20, 10 times bigger than Quake Champions is. And there are so many single player games as well. XCOM 2, for example. Current players. Ah, XCOM 2, sorry, that must be the new XCOM. I, I thought that this was... Yeah, this is the new one. Never mind. I thought that it was the old one. That would have been hilarious.
Okay, six late and four T. He has an interesting set of champions. Galena, Ranger, and Sorlax. Yeah, that's actually one of the biggest surprises to me. Euro Truck Simulator 2. Henu was telling me about it as well, and it's just unbelievable. I probably should have gone for that railgun first. Oh, it's jump war. The rail to bridge jump is now so much easier when I change my sensitivity. My LG is a lot worse, I think, but... But, but, moving is so much better. Again, everything works today. You're a big fan of American Truck, Sim truck Simulator. Uh, what is the game like? I've never played it. Is it anything like Flight Simulator but just for big trucks? What do you do there? Do you like deliver stuff from one place to another or...? And is it a single player or multiplayer? How does it work? Oh, too slow. Or sort of like was too bad. I think he would have won that fight actually had he thrown the totem, but he didn't so... That was a good warm up. Yeah, this <laughs> this opponent wasn't good at all. Now tell me, because you apparently you like big rigs. <laughs> uh, do you think you can learn how to drive a truck by playing this game? Yeah, well, that sounds handy. Maybe I will give it a try. If I ever have to steal a truck or save my life by driving one, then it would be nice to know how to drive one.
I mean, you never know if you get to experience the judgment day like in Terminator and you, you need to ride that truck with liquid nitrogen, nitrogen then it would be good to know. <laughs> All right. Uh, I, I somehow get the appeal of the game that you want to see the scenery. Uh, I get to drive so much in Europe anyway. I mean, I get to drive. I drive quite a bit in, uh, in Europe. So I have to say that I really don't feel like playing a game where I would have to drive. I hate driving. I love traveling and I love to see new places, go to nature and see beautiful sceneries, but I hate the driving. I even hate to sit in the car, even if someone else is driving, like my wife. Oh, I don't really feel like playing a driving simulator. <clears throat> Tim Willits for president. Unturned. What is that like? I've never heard of it either. I would actually like to play some single player game or a cooperative game and stream it. Because multiplayer competitive games. I naturally, naturally like them. I, I haven't played them for 20 years and hated them. But some, sometimes I feel like I would like to play something where I can just either be alone or play together with my mates. Vote now. Um, I have to I have to admit that I haven't played almost any new games or in general like after the 90s I haven't played almost anything besides arena FPS games and well CSGO I have played quite a bit But other than that, I haven't played almost anything. I played Path of Exile, um, then the role-playing game, uh, Divinity, the original Sin. I would love to play the second one, but I haven't bought it yet. We had plans to play it with Henu, but he has already played the game, so... I guess I will be playing it maybe alone and maybe I will stream it. And that's pretty much it. And no, I, I really wasn't good <laughs> in CSGO. I did reach Global Elite, but 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 I think I have to thank Heno and some of his friends. I wasn't doing much there. Okay. 
and he's on that side. 30. Now there should be more than enough time between the items. Come on, where are you? Is he still at the armor? No, he's there. Crap! Ugh. Just made it. <clears throat> How much health did I have? Like... 16? Not very much. Um... there. There's a small rocket. Oh, they were. Hmm. How I didn't get them in time? Because I ran out of rockets. I tried to shoot more rockets and just didn't shoot. Oh, that was close. Yes. That was an important rail. <laughs> I'm so bad. That should have never happened. So, so bad. And I think he has the ghost walk ready again. Because of the crazy amount of uh, our glasses. Nice LG. Really nice. Not a bad rocket either. Uh. Prepare to fight. Round begins in three. Okay, two, better now. One round fight. Three. He got the mega. He's still there. Nice rockets. Yes! No! Finally! That was scary. He was able to steal... Wait, where will he go? No, he went for I was thinking about... Uh, going to... Meet him at Heavy, but then I thought that Okay, maybe he will go for the rocket. But he didn't. That's a good rocket. Okay. Hmm. That was an interesting attack. Maybe he thought that I didn't 
go for the armor or That would have been a fresh had I hit it. My left wrist hurts some somehow now. It doesn't feel good. Maybe I'm getting old. works really well against Doom Slayer. You get that one extra chance if you just use your spike in time. Almost did the same to me using the spike with the anarchy. Surviving with very little, but luckily he didn't hit too hard afterwards. I have to fall back. Yes, he will. <laughs> I was afraid of that. It was a good decision not to go for the health there. Here. I will let him just get the armor, I, I need to stack. Mm. Well, good initial rockets, but he just rushed way too much. Didn't even Three, use the ghost walk. Just give up. Go for the armor. Too late. He shouldn't have much of the mega health left. He's there. Going for the armor. Or he got it already, but... The 
worst fight in a long time. Will I make it? Not quite. Those timings are actually something that I still don't know in this game so well. Like there, if you go through the telly, uh, when do you still have a chance to make it in time to Mega? If, if for example, you have an Anarchy going in front of you. Because I'm, sh I'm pretty sure that going to the left after exiting the telly is faster. But how much faster? I, I don't know. <clears throat> Hello, Bastard and Vesti and DCR and everyone. Oh, thanks for the feedback. Uh, I. Uh, the, it's good to hear that you like my stream compared to other players. I don't want to talk down on anyone, but I've noticed that many streamers, especially good players, not necessarily in Quake Champions, but for example in CSGO, they, they don't interact with their viewers in any way. And it seems like they are doing the stream only because it's part of their uh, sponsorship agreement. They are just streaming, but they are either not talking at all or just talking in, in voice and never interacting with, with their viewers. And I just find it very boring. Uh, I just don't want to watch streams like that personally and I try to make a stream that would appeal to myself I mean I'm not doing this for myself because I'm not I'm not watching my own stream but I'm just trying to think of ways to make the stream interesting But there are many great streamers as well. Many really great streamers. And the funny thing is that, in my opinion, the most entertaining streams are not by people who are necessarily very good players, but they are just great personalities, really fun to watch. <clears throat> Unfortunately, I can't change my personality, so this is what you will get. Oh, look who's there. There's Clutch. Not a bad move. Oh, I missed it. Okay, this time I did it. It's so weak. Whoa, what a fight. 15 health. That was close. That as well. Scary times. Not bad rockets. That was a really quick round, but so close against the clutch. Prepare to fight. <clears throat> round begins ja hyvää itsenäisyyspäivää, jos olette Suomesta. <clears throat> In case you didn't know, Finland turned 100 years yesterday. Nice LG. Oh, 
<laughs> there would have been a direct there. Hmm. Well played. It's great to have some clutch practice. I mean, I can always play clutch if I want, but finding other people who play clutch, that is all another story. Yes! Yeah, did you see that? A mid-air on the fastest character in the game and in the history of Arena FPS games as well. Very impressive stuff. No, oh, dude, don't, don't do it. Well, I was so sure that I would hit there. <laughs> really close rounds, really fast rounds and fun to play, but I think... Well, he got one frag already. He almost deserves a round. I feel ashamed for using the ghost. Uh, no, the berserk there. Probably should have. Ah, he actually. Goddamn anarchy. So fast. Not a bad rocket. I lost actually quite a bit of my stack there. I was already falling down, and somehow I still hit it. Just crazy stuff. I'm happy that it will be fixed. Was it a direct? Did I time it right? I just knew that I, I, I don't have any chance of making it alive, so... I wanted to deal some damage. He flew over. Over to that ledge there. But actually, he fell down somehow. Yeah, I, I try to be myself. Of course, uh, I can't be as relaxed here in front of the camera, I think, that I could be otherwise. And I, I hate to talk with these headphones, because they insulate the sound so much that... I don't know, it's just difficult for me to speak English with the headphones. It gets easier with time, but especially when I start the streams, it, feels awkward. And it's not because I don't use English much, because I quite often speak English with my wife as well. Uh, it's just so much easier without the headphones. Prepare for draft. Hello, Gage. 
Oh, it's your thirsty. I will try something stupid and play with Slash. I'll try not to tilt too much. Things usually go well with Slash as long as I don't see anyone. Then when I end up in fights, especially uh, when I end up being in fights where the opponent knocks me with a rocket and is quite close to me, then all goes to shit. And also, I, I can use this speed of Slash quite well to move around the map and get from items to... like, from one item to another. But then... I, I just don't use her movement in fights almost at all. Or I might try to use the crowd slide in the battles but then I just hurt myself because I get stuck somewhere. Let's see how it goes this time. I will start with Slash. That's it. Goodbye, Slash. I won't miss you. At all. Unfortunate death would have been <laughs> okay. I guess he knew the spawns quite well then. Prepare to fight. <clears throat> Round begins again. It seemed like he absolutely knew that I was coming from that direction. Strongest anarchy ever. Six late. Press it again. But I, I at least tried this time. I tried to double attack the ability, but didn't work. <laughs> That's unbelievable. I had seven health. <laughs> it just flies over the edge. <clears throat> it totally saved my ass as well. There, there was no way I was going to survive otherwise. So 
so hard to aim against that white background. I very much dislike the heavy armor room. <laughs> the luckiest rail ever, I didn't even see him. Party. Well, that was a good rocket. That was actually a read, not just a random rocket. I don't know, it feels like I get hit too much when I play Sora like. I should probably try her again. That was so lucky. I was so sure that he will get the. There you go. That was close. <clears throat> My slash is just horrible. But I think I just have to play her because I just get frustrated when I can't combine her absolutely magnificent movement with the fighting skills that I have. I can either move or fight, but that's it. That's it. We didn't play Blood Run yet with this guy. I wonder if he wants to play more. Seems like he does. Vote now. Run. Yes, I. Prepare for draft. I think Sorlag wasn't as powerful as everyone thought 
she was. But also we have to remember that LG got nerfed quite heavily as well. Uh, which helps at the moment the smaller characters quite a bit. So that plays a role there, but I never thought that Sorlag was as powerful as everyone made her to be. Now it's it's quite hard to play Sorlag well. You have to be quite I don't know, fast and careful at the same time. You have to capitalize on on the weaknesses of your opponents really fast, and you have to be ready to use rocket jumps. If you try to, I don't know, play kind of slow game, you might end up taking a lot of damage that you can't really answer. And even if you can, a smaller champion can restack really fast. Whereas, as a Sorlag, you can have really hard time restacking. And that is the that is the thing you have to your advantage. The bigger stack, and if you end up losing it all the time to easy rails, then you're going to have a bad time with Sorlag. Was a good rocket. Too bad he didn't fall down. Whoa, that shotgun! Check my stack. I had mega health and ended up with what 37 health. That is just nuts. Fun. I the jump. Did I help him No. A real panic button there. Why she didn't take the armor? I'm here. I just can't see shit against Nyx. Especially those darker skins. Whoa. I already thought that I would die. I think... Good evening, Rotten Rose. I think the patch is out not yet. Yes, that's what I wanted. Uh... This... This punch is just stupid. Uh, both ways there. This... I just really don't get it. I had mega health. This LG is... Wait, what? Hmm. Well, 
played. <laughs> it would have been nice to get the kill there. Had I had the rocket, I would have used Ghost Walk and attacked, but now it's quite difficult. <laughs> yes, he died as well. <laughs> I was worried Prepare with her ghost walk. Round begins in three. But yeah, how did I die so fast Round with my slash? Fight. I had full 25 armor, mega health. Uh, how is it even... It was just like an insta-death. I do not get it. We Slash is happy about my rail. Me too. Okay, GG. <clears throat> Luckily, I I'm streaming. I really want to see what happened there at Railgun. How did I take so much damage? Because I should have had 150 health and... 25 armor, that is 175. It should take three punches for me to die. And I just died instantly. Did he shoot me with SSG and then one punch? But I think he didn't even go for SSG because I think he spawned SNG and jumped straight for the armor and then fell down, without getting the armor even. I mean, that doesn't matter. Update is in progress. Huh. Okay. Uh, I wonder if this is the December update or something else. Ah, I missed the Mega, or left the Mega there. Okay, well that kind of explains it. That makes it more understandable. Then two punches would have killed me. Yeah, I know that I, I skipped the small armor, but uh, doesn't Slash spawn with 25 armor anyway? I know that I skipped the small armor, but yeah, I didn't remember that I skipped the mega as well, that's true. But still, it should have taken two hits for me to die. Um, my fob is 125. I... Some days ago I still played with 115, but... In case you didn't know, I'm a Quake World player, and 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 there I play with 137 when I'm using a widescreen monitor. If I'm using a narrow monitor, then it's 125. Um, but I don't know. Uh, I was playing some a map called End in. Quake World, and I realized that there's nothing wrong with my aim. I I can hit really good mid-airs quite consistently with my relatively high Quake World sensitivity and really high fob. So I decided to give it a try here in Quake Champions as well. 
I have very similar sensitivity now and a bit lower fob. I I tried 100, 137 fob here in Quake Champions, which would be exactly the same that I have in Quake World, but that that didn't look good at all. That with that it felt like it would be really hard to, for example, rail test like you ask. But with this 125, I don't find it very difficult to rail. I mean, my rail is not very good to begin with, but I think FOB is not the reason. It's just that I'm not used to the weapon. And in Quake World, in the Instagip modes there, I actually rail pretty well. Around 50% quite consistently over three minutes where you shoot with rail all the time. But it's it, in Quake Champions, it's more about the angles and about the way the characters move and also the hitbox sizes. So all that makes quite a big difference. Because in Quake World, I tend to aim really a lot with my movement and then only making kind of micro adjustments with the mouse. But in Quake Champions, it feels like I, at least I personally, end up using my mouse a lot more for aiming. This will be bad, but he will hate me as well. I have the smallest champions in the game. All three. Real hate picks. I've lost my phone. Well, I guess no one will call me anyway. This one's gonna be epic! Take it easy, big guy, he says, and I'm facing Nyx. Nyx doesn't exactly look big or guy. Okay, let's try with Slash again. Will be a nightmare, but... Can you do starting with that one? Okay, all the weapons. Oh, combo kill. You. That's not fair. But I think he must go there. Yep, there he was. Okay, good rockets. Good rockets and goodbye. I'm not sure where to go now. That rocket! Oh, it was so close. It was almost a direct, I think. I'm quite 
glad he didn't follow me there. Because I would have been in a bad spot. Whoa. Whoa! That rocket that I hit there, that direct, that was so strange. I have no idea how it happened. Too bad he made it out of that hallway there. That was bad. <sighs> to fight. Round begins in three, two, Such a good start, and then I... Fight. End up dying to his rage. Hey, he really took his time. Come on. Where did you go? Hey, that was... That was good. Okay, Slash is doing work. But I even slid backwards once to get away from his rocket. That that is that's like advanced technique for my slash. I will take the LG as well. that he was there or a guest I didn't exactly know but Sometimes LG still works in this game. It's good that I picked it up. When you have enough cells, 
it's enough even if you don't hit your shots all that well. Yeah. I knew that he was there. Waiting for... Jump on his lap. Naughty Ranger. Dead. Anarchy is so much easier. Prepare to fight. Round begins in three, two, one. Fight. Real tired of being on the receiving end here. Let's go for the LG again. Maybe it will help. Real delay. Must be her birthday. Okay, he's a rocket. And he used his dire orb. Good times for me, that means. GG. Yeah, I played quite a bit of... Or quite a few pro players. More in Quake World though, but I played, I don't know, almost all the European top players, A Agent, Cooler, Kills and Wu, uh, Toxic. Actually the Swedes I haven't played, Sparty and... Um, fast. Th those, those have been avoiding me. Uh, I don't know if Ikaba is a pro player, but I, I played against him many a time. Strengths, yeah, yesterday. Uh, I've been able to take a map from everyone but except for Picava I think I've lost most of the games but the games have been quite close especially lately with this newest patch it's been a lot better for me with the first patch uh, I hadn't had as much practice as I've had now and LG was a lot better in that patch and rockets were a lot worse so that didn't suit my play style all that well so there i took a hard beating but nowadays i've been able to steal a map here and there and the games that i have lost have mostly been really close ah cypher as well as i have played The greatest Quake World player of all time. This has been asked quite a bit. Um, I don't like to say myself. Uh, that just so, feels so wrong. I mean, 
everyone could say that, yeah, I'm the best player. And you will hear it so often. Uh, you can go and check the Quake World wiki page and see the tournaments that I have won and played. I think there are quite a few of them. Um, other than myself, now that we can look back 20 years of Quake World, 21 years even, um, I don't know. I, I value all all round players a lot, and there haven't been really all that many. Hib is one the player who uh, the Finnish player who played for Slackers and TVS. He knew how to play one on one. He knew how to play two on two. He knew how to play four on four, and he didn't only know how to play those game modes, but especially in four on four and Two on two, he was one of the best, and in one on one, really, really good as well. Uh, then the Dutch player Repi, he was absolutely one of the best players of all time. Really, really good in all game modes, just like Hib. He was probably better in one on one than Hib, or I, yes, we must. I mean, I have to be able to say that he he was better in one on one than Hib, because Repi just won so many one on one tournaments. Um, that he and although he didn't win all that many four and four tournaments, he did win a couple, I think, and he was an excellent two on two player. Uh, yes, paradox, absolutely. He's one of the best players of all time. Um, Doug, while an excellent player, I'm not putting him on this list because in one on yes, you can say that he was, well, good. He was great in all game modes, but what Dak lacked was the versatility in maps. He absolutely refused to play anything else besides TB3, both in, or, okay, uh, in one-on-one. -on -one. In four and four, he actually played at least CMT4 and one of the, one other CMT map, because they were in the map pool. But he never played Airwalk or ZTNDM3 in tournaments, as far as I know. So he's not on this list. And there are many others. Recall is an excellent player as well. Absolutely beastly one on one player and also a good, a great two on two player, but not a bad four on four player either. So. Die, please. No, I missed the rocket. Okay, he had, I don't know, two health. Ah, don't get stuck. We need the mega. I didn't get the rail yet. That's not good. Again, I was going for the rail. But yeah, there might be other players that I'm just forgetting now, but... On the, on the top of my head, those are the names that I came up with.
Paradox, absolutely. He is a great player. Or boss, I don't know how he plays now. He might be a great player in poker. Not in Quake so much anymore. Although I'm sure he would get there. He gets the rail. I'm the worst trailer ever. Ah, uh, let's go for the armor then, I'm in a hurry. I'm sure he hates the timing. He just jumped away as the Mega spawned and couldn't make it back in time. To fight. Yeah, I know OK98. He's a nice guy. I like to play with him. And we actually quite often play two on two. OK98 plays with, maybe you know Splash? I don't know if you know him, but he's a friend of his. I mean, Splash is a friend of OK98's. And we like to play two on two against them. Really good games. And I, I've met OK98, he was at QuakeCon as well as q 8 Slam. Sucks that I didn't get the raid. Why did I go in with rail? That was horrible. That was also stupid to attack because even though I won, which I shouldn't have, he will get the armor. Uh, but that's Milton for you. Sometimes goes for fights that he shouldn't. Whoa, 10 hell. Okay, 150 damage there. And I hit one rail before. I hate SSG in this game, it's just too powerful in my opinion. <laughs> well played. Not bad at all. He got away and he got three of the hourglasses there. And he got the ghost walk again. No, he doesn't have much. I wonder if he had Ghost Walk ready already. He had taken six hourglasses, so it must have been at least really close. Round begins in three, two, one. Round three. Fight. Yeah, I saw Rotten Rose that they are planning next QH land. I already answered the survey they had. Nail 
shotgun damage was absolutely crazy. giving me any free angles there. Mm, I hate this map sometimes. I also hate the double music. I mean, no nothing wrong with the music, but just listening to it two times in a row. While playing, it's not very good. Eleven health. <clears throat> the best move ever. No, don't kill me now. That's nice of you. about one late. Can I catch him with rail? Not quite. And just in time he gets it. That's better. Ah, oh, it's not over yet. Of course it's not. Already ready for the overtime. I mean, I thought that we were already in sudden death. GG. Congratulations, you have been selected to win 2,000 favor for Quake Champions. Well, that is amazing. I just wonder, why do they give favor instead of a backpack? Because as far as I know, there's no other way to use favor than to buy backpacks. So what is the point? Just give me the backpack so I don't have to buy it and then open it.
let's see. Rail was horrible, as always. LG and Rocket were okay. <laughs> That's it, I guess. Buy this. Light weapon shader. I'm going to use it. Doom Slayer. That is something that I might be able to fulfill. Let's see what it is. I can see it here. Airborne 30 times. Well, okay. That will take some time, but. So this one, what was it? I think it was finished 30 games. Um, uh, isn't there some kind of matchmaking already in Quake Champions? At least that's what I always thought, and I'm I'm actually really sure that there is. I've heard Tim Willits say, or Sync Error, I'm not sure, but I think it was Tim Willits, maybe. Uh, and he, he knows his stuff, he never lies. So apparently the level you are at doesn't matter at all, but there is still some kind of matchmaking behind the curtains. Because I keep on facing really good players, and then when a friend of mine, Henu, who hadn't played the game almost at all, who plays Quake World with me, uh, he played the game and he said that he won his 10 first games really easily. And that certainly wasn't the case at the same time when I was searching for games. So I, I can't believe that it could be random. So do you think that uh, if Quake Champions was free to play, hordes of players would join? I wish, because if hordes of players will try the game, it means that someone will stick around and we will have more players than we started with. I just think that even if the game was free to play, we wouldn't have those players. I mean, we, we wouldn't see the hordes of players coming. Unfortunately. Blood run. Let's practice slash. Okay, let's do it. Slash, sore lag, and... Oh, he has the... He has Doom Slayer. Maybe I will have to take Doom as well. Yeah, I, I have to. Otherwise, I, I will lose for sure. I still might lose, but... In addition to Sorlag and Slash, I will need someone proper. Because I think my Sorlag will be really rusty. Here. I'm just reading the chat here. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, you might be right that you can rent champions with favor. Okay, my bad then. Right, 
Let's go. Uh, I got that one hit. Whoa, not bad, SSG. Not bad at all. I thought that I'd lose the fight for sure after giving him the first free hit. That wasn't the case. Should be weak. Will he go for the hell? Didn't have the time. Yeah, I'm sure a Koskin Korva character would be perfect for the game. Come on, take the weapon, woman. So we. Stronger than I thought. That was a failure. Not GG yet. Prepare to fight. Round begins in three, two, one. Round three. Fight. What a strange start. Double tap that ability. Not a good move. <laughs> nice. Seems like he was as surprised by being stuck there as I was. So he missed his shot, but then double jumped just in time to get the armor. Laughter. 
24! I wanted 94. That's better. A remake of Quake World. Uh, that would be something. That would be something and that would be interesting, but I I highly doubt that it would save the arena FPS as a Sandra, unfortunately. As much as I love Quake World, I, I don't know. It just seems like there are not very many people who enjoy the arena fps games they are just i don't actually know what it is because it's not only the hardcore nature of the games because these same people play games that require an immense amount of skill like cs and those games for example cs can be absolutely punishing, in my opinion. You die in a round, assuming that you are playing the, for example, matchmaking that is very popular. Uh, you die once, and if you happen to be one of the first people to die in your team, you end up waiting through the whole round, and then uh, through the buying period and even after that you spend quite a big part of the uh, round just walking into a position and just waiting there spotting for opponents so i don't know it's there's so much waiting in cs and then you get to fight for maybe five seconds sometimes even less if you just get headshotted, then that's it. That's the round for you. And then you wait again for a minute or two or even three sometimes. Well, maybe not quite three, but a minute or two easily. Uh, well, hell, I got global as well. So that is not saying anything. I'm horrible in Counter-Strike and I got global. But to be really good in CS, it's, it requires quite a bit more than getting to global. Alright. Agent. Let's see. survived and we'll get maybe the rocket oh that was a good attack oh a direct he can't be so strong Yes! 
<laughs> I knew that he couldn't be so strong. I mean, of course, he got the Mega. Whoa. But even with the Mega, he also ate a lot of rocket. I should have seen it coming. Such a simple move. Nice direct. <laughs> really nice direct. <clears throat> I didn't remember the rocket pack there. Almost hurt me. Quite badly. Uh, yes, I'm going to participate in at least if there are uh, any qualifiers for land tournaments. I didn't wait. bad he will be able to stack quite heavily now but well not not heavily enough not for damage like that oh dear I was afraid that he would, he would use the ghost walk to get to the armor I just had to go like he did in the first round.
Yes! Ah, oh, he got the rocket. That's not good. Will they come back and rave? Yeah. Take it slow now. Okay, that's six lane. That was interesting. I thought that he would continue. With the uh, orb. <laughs> and there, he thought that I would be running away only with the anarchy. <laughs> then, when I dealt a bit of damage, he still thought that I would be running away. And then, after turning around, he didn't even realize that I was at the heavy already. Oh, why I didn't go? Oh, that's actually not too bad. He lost quite a bit. Come out of his stack as well. Yeah, he will get both of the items. Okay, thirteen. Oh, <laughs> I failed the jump. Okay then. Oh. I played so well there. I agent had no idea what was going to happen. I I would have oh, I fooled him completely, and then I then I just failed the goddamn jump. Airborne, airborne. All right. Eat that. So weak. I will go for a days. Eat. Ah, uh, you didn't probably see it. I think. My NVIDIA drivers just clipped the wall and I saw the red triangle through the wall. Ah, oh, he came. That's bad. Seconds longer, and I would have gotten to Telefrag. <sighs> Three, two, Almost. One, one, okay, thank you. He actually shot me there to the heavy. Really 
can't challenge this. Go. Ah, oh, this is so bad. This double again. Rocket now. No, it's a bit better. The worst trail ever. Could he come here? I highly doubt it. Just 19, I think. He's so weak. And the mega is up. Oh crap. One hell. <clears throat> Come on, health. I need you. That was a close game. I wonder how much health he had there when I spawned with Anarchy. <clears throat> anarchy to LG didn't hit any cells whatsoever there. But not a bad game. Mm.
Not a bad game. All right, Yoxmeister, let's go. Hello, Quakefield. Long time no see. Where have you been? And more importantly, why you didn't come to QH land this year? You should have been there. And how 9000? I'm almost using the Quake World sensitivity now. Um, what I did, uh, I discussed this a bit before. Um, I use a bit higher f uh, fog in Quake World, which is 137. In Quake Champions, I use 125. So using the exact same sensitivity with this lower fob made it feel faster than it actually is i know that it's only in my head it's because um not as much changes on your screen when you have fi higher fob and the same sensitivity uh compared to the situation where you have lower fob and the same sensitivity for example if you put some insane zoom fob like fob 25 and use the same sensitivity it feels really fast because what you see on your screen changes so much so because of that i just checked like mm, like what what is 125 out of out of 137 and then multiply my <clears throat> sensitivity with that number so my sensitivity in quake champions is a bit lower than in quake world but not by much because the it's like 9.6 percent lower i think it was <clears throat> oh today is the esl comp mm, i'm not sure if i'm ready to play it anymore i've been Grinding one on one already so much. I always forget about it. Prepare to fight. Round begins. All right, let's do it. <laughs> Yorks. Ah, of course he had the rocket already. That's not very optimal, is it? Give him the armor for this rocket. It's quite late, I think. Actually, not not as late as I thought. I mean, the armor was delayed quite a bit as well. This rocket. Uh... Raylan SNG. Not bad. 
bad. That's a bad rocket. Whoa, what was that? I wonder if I have some kind of Windows updates or something on in my Windows 10. Because every now and then I get that. Annoying lag. Hmm, nice rockets. I didn't even realize that I was getting hit so hard. about dying. Punch is so annoying because there's no delay, you don't have to wait for any weapon switches. Makes it so powerful. Yeah, Noctis, I really hate the drop quad in 2 on 2 as well. Very annoying. Still hits the red. Hmm. 
interestingly. No damage at all. Splash damage in this game is sometimes so strange. Like, where did I shoot the rocket at heavy? Not to hit anything there. I stole them. I even saw it, but just couldn't do anything about it anymore. Yeah, probably shouldn't have even gone for the mega. Okay. You must die now. Bit of scale, but not much. He left the rockets there. That's cool. Taking away the light armor. already there. The 15 second armor timer is so short. So difficult to run the items. If not absolutely impossible. Maybe with anarchy you can do it.
<laughs> Not quite. That was close, though. Ah, they left the armor there. Okay. Do I hit the rail? Probably not. the nail gun in this game or super nail gun that is <laughs> GG Yeah, Doom's ability is just stupid. I it I like Doom Slayer otherwise, just make the ability somehow a lot harder to use. It should be really a lot harder to hit. Okay, I guess one more with Mr. Chucks. <clears throat> yeah, I've removed the lock on, I just, yeah, I guess that could be it. I like the speed boost and And I think the damage is fine. Maybe, maybe lower the rate of punch, <laughs> rate of fire, rate of punch. I mean, the rate at which you can punch. You punch maybe a bit too fast. Getting four punches out, for example, towards Sorlag is quite brutal. And also, I think, well, I hope they will fix the delay stuff, the, which is not there at the moment. You just insta-hit 75. I think it even hits just with the ability button. You don't even have to press attack, or I'm not sure, but sometimes it feels like I just get an auto-hit when I'm nearby an enemy. Yeah, I, I hope after the patch, Doom will still be usable, but the ability has been fixed. Because although the double jump is really, really good as a passive ability, I think it's not that bad because of the bigger hitbox. Good LG aimers really destroy Doom Slayer with LG at the moment. Be weak, so weak. Let's take this and okay, get stuck there then. Can I get both the items? Yes, I can. 
this should be good. And it is good. He was there. Well, I've been able to steal away most of the items. He can't have much. But he has good timing. Ooh. Okay, I really didn't expect that. HP. about dying. There you go. Hello, Boris. Prepare to fight. Welcome to the stream. Round begins in three, two, one. Round two, fight. Quite. Could have been a nice direct because the rocket went through the hole there. I missed the rocket pickup the second time. Not very handy. One punch would have done it. Not bad. Have to start playing now. Not a good rocket jump for him. Seven, eight. And sixteen. And I will get this. You got it. <laughs> Prepare to fight. 
All is good. Just had a good game against uh, Agent. I lost two to three, but it was close. I actually like playing Agent. He, he seems like a nice guy. Although I know that his reputation perhaps isn't so nice, but... All the armor, that's always good. So this armor as well. He's so weak. Ah, again with Nyx. These are guys. Did he get it? No. So nice to have timing of items sometimes. Okay. <laughs> that was unexpected. I didn't know how that he was that weak. No way! <laughs> how do you, how do you hit Nyx with the goddamn orb and even telefrag her? That is, mm. I hate dire orb. He didn't die? Okay. I have no idea where the last rocket went. Whoa. That's frustrating. Tilt will lose me the round. Ah, well, tilt to that one. <laughs>
Okay. That's better. That was a tight one. <clears throat> Hello, face. Not much. Just playing, playing some duels here. It's been better better today than yesterday. Yesterday I was tilting a bit. Didn't like the game all that much. Today I I only lost against Age, and it was two to three, and it, it was a good game. Okay. Um. All right, I think Yox is done. Yeah, good games. All right, video, we can play maybe two more and then I'm done. Hello, Heno. Nice red armors there. I wish we had red armors in Quake Champions as well. No such luck. I hope they won't ruin the game with the new patch. There are so many good things in the new patch, but I'm just worried about the bigger stacks. That doesn't sound good at all. We'll see. I hope soon enough. December 2018. My landlord also promised to give me a new table soon. You wouldn't believe the table I'm using at the moment. <clears throat> ah, right. So they won't change the hitboxes at all. <laughs> well, that, that is wonderful. I guess I will be playing Anarchy then. Should be fun. Anarchy who just absolutely refuses to die. Yeah, 200, 150, <laughs> sword lag. That's amazing. <clears throat> yeah, I remember them saying, telling about the new hitboxes. I mean, the new, new hitboxes, but I just thought that they would change the hitboxes with the kind of original way or use the blanket versions now for this December patch and then the new new stuff would come afterwards but apparently not then okay well a new map that can't arrive soon enough we definitely need a new map we need 15 new maps I'm sick of playing DM6 and even Blood Run. Blood Run is one of my favorite maps in the game, but it's an old map. I want to learn something new. Sarnath is a nice map. Keep 
I initially I liked it a lot. Nowadays, maybe not as much anymore. Punching competition, yes, I won. I'm the Mike Tyson of Quake Champions. Too bad you can bite people's ears off with the Doomslayer. That would be amazing. Um, I have the Quake 2 Railgun actually, and I, I was using it for quite a while, but then they changed the, the, the rail model, or I mean, the, I don't know if it's a particle, but anyway, the beam, the, the rail itself, so it blocks the view a bit too much at the moment. I feel. That was laggy. <laughs> Had I been able to steal that one, it would have been amazing. <laughs> okay, he had zero ammo. That's that's hilarious. God just jumping all over the place with with berserk on and <laughs> he can't kill me. And I, I'm not hitting anything, but I, I was avoiding everything as well. Okay. Pro rail. And I will give him the rocket for the heavy. SSG, way too powerful. But punches, even more so. <clears throat> well, it, it's nice that they are at least going for two on two. That's better than nothing. That was a mess, why I didn't attack earlier with the punches. Definitely should have gone with the punches there himself. Prepare to fight. Round begins in three, two, one. Round three, fight. Someone didn't quite realize that I was behind him. Ah, oh, I... Well, that was bad. 
This is a comedy show at the moment. This time I will remember that Mega is before it, the heavy. Nice rocket. And he should have gone for the... Gone for the Mega. be so deceiving sometimes. GG! Yeah, sore leg with maybe a bikini and suspenders. What else could be better? I dare you. Nothing. Yeah, I knew you would like it. <laughs> Everyone is just over the moon with this idea. Yeah, go and tell Team Village. He will make our dreams come true. Yeah, let's do it one more. Ah, oh, more blood run. I will try with slash again. Let's practice. Practice, practice, practice. Yeah, well, any skin would be better than the Anarchy Lore skin. That is just horrible. <clears throat> I mean, listen to Slash. That, that's what Anarchy should sound like. But maybe Anarchy sounds so annoying because he looked so annoying before he turned into Anarchy. That must be it. Prepare to fight. Okay. Round Let's tilt with slash. Three, two, one. Round one. Fight. Shouldn't have much. It was 96 damage with the first shotgun and all right, that's good. I will even get the rocket. What? 
Ah, oh, he must have rocket jumped so much that he died. He's so weak. Okay. Crash dump sending utility. Well, that's it then, I guess. Quake Champions doesn't want me to play anymore. Report sent. <clears throat> I wonder if Vidya is still here. Yeah, that, that was a fast rage quit. Oh, I can I can finish the one on one. I wonder. No, it won't let me join. I was too slow, and I don't know if I could have joined anyway. This is interesting because I haven't had the game crash in a long, long time. This is the first crash in a month, at least, if not more. Where can a city girl get a little action around here? Okay. It's Mr. Vidya. There. <clears throat> okay, last, last one. That one didn't count. But I will be back tomorrow, I think. I have a free day tomorrow, so... I have time for streaming during the day. Depending on when I wake up, I could maybe start streaming around... Uh, 1 p.m. CET. Or 2, or 3. Depends on when I wake up. I don't have a schedule. <laughs> Hello, Devogan. I'll do my best. I will try to murder my enemies. Crush my enemies and see them driven before me and hear the lamentation of their women. Best things in life. Mm, nice rail. Fourteen damage didn't really help me all that much.
Nice rocket. That risk taking didn't really pay off. With Doomslayer, you don't have to take risks. Just punch them in the face. so interesting that the punch actually missed if missing the punches uh, was more frequent then then the berserk wouldn't be nearly as good because when you miss a punch that actually sucks big time almost as much as falling down with uh, with slash He's so weak. Two punches, I think. Really, I SSG, way too powerful. Oh, that was close. That must have been a direct, yeah. And it was quite a risky direct as well, because I would have died to one rail. Okay, next, we are magic, save the day. <laughs> no, she didn't save the day. Then. Two, one. Round three. Fight. Slash match. That is a mistake so easy to make, I think. At least I do it really often. Attacking the spawn without realizing that, okay, it's a doom guy that I'm facing. And then getting punched in the face. Your video was so weak that it wouldn't have made any sense to attack, I think, against anyone. Because the starting weapons are so powerful. As, for example, Gauntlet would have killed him as well. Maybe I even could have saved the punch there and killed him with gauntlet. But anyway, even if you have a relatively high stack attacking Doomslayer. It's always dangerous. I consider myself lucky there. Ah, oh, he didn't come this way. God damn. <laughs> yes! Yes! I'm getting this.
right, that's it. Well played, good games. <clears throat> it was really good slash practice. I there were some good moves. Getting a bit better with her. Still not very good, but better. I still have to remember to use the plasma trail and just like think about the situations where it can be used. I I almost never use it. Yeah, good games, Vidya. Yeah. Uh, and good games, everyone. I think I will finish the stream here unless there is something magical happening in Quake World. Um, doesn't really look like it. They're playing a mixed game with really bad players, so I'm not going to join. Yeah, sometimes my rail is okay nowadays. It's it's getting there. Now, now I just have to really get used to this sensitivity, which is close to the sensitivity that I use in Quake World. But yeah, I it's already okay, I think. Rail is perhaps not my biggest problem. It's my problems are elsewhere, I think. Uh, yeah, TBS <laughs> reunion and one spot free. <laughs> that would be something, waiting to brag against CMF. That would be something. Uh, speaking of CMF, uh, if you know the player, the Finnish CMF player Fix, he was playing some days ago. We played some mixed games with him or one game maybe i'm not sure if he played more but it's good to have old players back they are always welcome and now i will open one more backpack and then we will find someone to host and i'm done oh look at that almost as good as the suspenders that is amazing Green lizard, just like they are in real life. <clears throat> All right, I think that's it. Um, the host, host T, I guess. Let's see, uh, is there anyone in Quake? Where do I see my friend list? Yes, Flames is he's mapping now, but he's a really nice guy. I like to host him. So I only remembered how to spell his nickname. Slash host F one four M three Z. That's it. Okay. Uh, if you have any questions, suggestions, anything, let me know in the chat. I will check it shortly. If not, then thanks for watching. It was great to have so many viewers again. I hope you enjoyed, and I will be back tomorrow with more Quake Champions, even with Quake World, if if we have players for it but until then goodbye good night thanks for watching